With the formula Roblox update getting closer every day, I thought I'd show you guys what is coming in that update. So there is this league game where they test everything that they add in an update and they actually use this stuff for their league as well. And there's a bunch of cool features here that you guys are gonna enjoy. So if we go to collection, we can see all the different cars they have. You can see these are the default liveries, like the real life liveries. This is the Aston Martin, this is the Ferrari, this is the McLaren. They have a bunch of uh, custom liveries here and some of them are inspired on real life cars like this is the silver arrows here is the alpine for example as well it's not like an exact replica but it also exists but as you can see these cars are mesh cars like the tires are different the car models are different and i think they look absolutely fantastic like they've done an amazing job on them the car does feel the same though they said they might switch up the handling but i don't know if they're actually going through with that because one of the iconic things about the game is like how it handles a lot of people prefer this game over other roblox f1 games because of them being able to play this game better it's the main thing is like there's no oversteer that's the thing i mean i wish they add a little bit of oversteer i enjoy a little bit of oversteer having to fight to the car and stuff maybe they can even add air setups i really don't know but this car looks amazing and another thing you might have noticed when i was spawning the car is that there were two new options which were the enters and the wets and they have actually a use in this game let's go ahead and change up the weather uh you can go here there are a lot of different weathers i'm gonna go with light rain and you can see all the rain particles down there in the bottom right it says 35 percent rain and 35 percent track i'm not really sure what that means i think it means the maximum rain it can reach is 35 percent and the track one means how much rain there is actually on the track so i assume the more you drive like the more rain you clear up like if there's a lot of people on track it might clear up rain i'm not sure we were gonna have to test that with more people which as you can see we're on the enters it automatically puts us on the enters and of course the main difference you're gonna feel in this game when there's gonna be rain like this is like it's a lot more understeer but i do have the race in line don't judge me for it i'm not the best at this game but yeah since they're adding stuff like this i can definitely see them also adding like drs maybe or maybe even even ERS I'm not quite sure but this update is definitely gonna switch up formula Roblox a lot and for the better if I'm being honest the game is gonna look so much better and it's gonna actually represent like how well it's made in terms of the core mechanics and features because the game has always been amazing and like a lot of people avoided the game just because of the way it looked like how blocky it looked and in my in my opinion that was very unfair so I'm glad they're going with the mesh cars and stuff I really am interested to see if they are gonna switch up the the handling of the car so far it does feel the same or at least what you would expect from the car to feel in the rain it seems to still be on 35 percent by the way something that i saw in this testing place or league place one time and i don't see it again is like it used to tell you like what the weather is gonna be in the next five minutes something similar to like how a set of course uh competition is i believe tells you like what the weather is gonna be like in the next five minutes 10 minutes 15 minutes like that so i'm not sure if they removed that or it's gonna be there for the main update I and mean, something like that can definitely help you make strategies way better instead of just having to like gamble on thinking if there's like a 10 percent chance of weather changing because that's like very lame to deal with in terms of strategy there you go i set a 116.5 so now we are on the wet tires you can see they are different like the grooves are different and there's 80 percent rain and you can see how much rain there is there's a lot of fog as well you can't see very well there's limited vision i think the quality on the video might be low because of the rain particles as well i wonder yeah there are there is spray as well okay that's gonna be interesting once we start racing oh my god okay so the racing lines are not made for the wet weather the racing lines are just for the dry so i need to break way way earlier oh my god like it actually feels like aquaplane like the car just goes but thankfully there is no overseer i wonder if more people are gonna start playing this game once this update comes out i don't know how long until the update comes out they haven't really specified the date but i assume it's getting closer maybe like this month april it might come out but if you guys remember i set a 116.5 earlier on the enters let's see what kind of times we set now oh my god that 
that hairpin every time the stupid racing line gets me there you go first sector done oh my god you can see i'm going wide every corner this is like basically driving on the softs if they were like at 100 percent tire wear in the main game a little bit of oversteer would make it spicier though and like a little bit more interesting maybe harder but more interesting for sure because right now you just have to deal with understeer you have to deal with understeer and oversteer that should be more exciting for sure but we are about to finish our lap it's gonna be like yep there you go it's 1.4 seconds slower than our other lap i'm not sure if our other lap was any good though three lights two lights one light and away we go oh my god how long is okay this is okay oh there you go it seems we are p1 track of that oleg dragon is just behind us he seems to be quick on these conditions and we just got there and goes a little slow down oh i forgot this is the short track oh my god i just went so wide because i forgot this is the short version seems we have fallen to p3 2.6 seconds behind the leader and it seems that this guy in front of me is on the softs most people are on the mediums there is someone on the hards i'd say 50 percent of the grid is mediums 50 is on softs and two people are on hards We are four seconds behind the leader now, come on. Oh, I keep getting those stupid cuts. Oh my god, he's just pulling away. Okay, we caught him a little bit there, but he's actually pulling away by a lot. Okay, we're way closer now. <laughs> okay, okay. We had a very nice exit there. Okay, we're pulling away from him now. We got a second gap to him, and we're only two seconds behind the leader. It was three seconds earlier. So we are definitely catching the leader. Look how much closer we are. We got a purple second sector as well. I think we might have a shot at an overtake in a couple of laps. Oh my god, we're getting closer. I can see him, I can smell him. Okay, let's avoid getting any slowdowns though. We're 1.4 seconds behind now. Oh my goodness. The gap was 2 seconds at the start of this lap or something. Oh, oh, he goes so wide. He went so wide there. Come on, give us the slipstream. Oh, the gap is 9 tenths. Come on, I believe I am in the slipstream. But yeah, he keeps going wide that corner every time. I don't think it's better because look how much closer we are. The gap is only 6 tenths. Oh, he goes very wide there. Hopefully he makes more mistakes though. Come on, we're keeping the car on the racing line. We go for the overtake. Are we ahead? We are ahead on our screen. It was on our leaderboard yet. Come on, go through this happen nicely. Oh, he! I thought he was a cut there. There you go. It says we are leading the race on the leaderboard. And we're currently on lap 9 out of 10. We're about to start our final lap soon. And let's try to mess him up with some dirty air. Oh my god, he's still very close to us. He's less than a tenth behind us. He might actually get us on the straight. He's going for the slipstream. We're one tenth ahead. Come on. We're pulling away. We're two tenths ahead. I can't believe it came down to the final lap, but it did. And we seem to have an insane... Oh my god, we have like a two second gap now. And I go slightly wide, but that's not going to be enough for him to catch up. We get the win of the race. And I'd say that wasn't an easy W. It was definitely very hard, but it was also fun. But yeah, that's pretty much all we know about the new update. Like, there's going to be new car models, maybe new cars. I think uh, they posted a new Ferrari model on the Discord. There is also going to be weather and, like, wet and inter tires. But I don't know what else might be coming. They're still working very hard on this update. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to smash that like button. Also, subscribe to the channel. We're almost at 4 k subs and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video i see you guys later goodbye